Trojan family, Trojan gang. Fight on forever is in the building. And today, we finna talk about two recruits that we've been following since way back, right? For months now. First one I want to tell y'all about is the kid I call Robocop. Jared Smith, 6-6 DN. Got bumped up to five star, five star DN right now, right? Five star, brush edge, whatever you want to call it. Down to his top three. He got USC in his top three. This would be a big grab if USC grabbed this kid a five star. Boost USC back up in the rankings. You know, once upon a time, USC had three five stars. They bumped Julian Lewis down to a four star. Isaiah Gibson and Justice Terry decommitted, right? So this would be a five star back on the board for USC. Now he got USC in this top three. But 247 is predicting him to go to Auburn, right? So we gonna see. His commitment date is August 3rd. So keep an eye out on Jerry Smith on August 3rd and cross your fingers. Y'all yeah, said cross your fingers. USC is in it for a lot of players. So even if we don't get this recruit, this at least one of these recruits, where if USC show and prove this season, right? They'll be able to flip some of these kids. USC gonna be able to flip some of these kids back, right? So keep an eye on these kids' commitment. See where SC finishing that, and you know this high school game is fickle. So whether we land a recruit or not, it ain't over. But Jared Smith is committing August third, so we gonna keep an eye on that. Robocop, five star, he's a monster. He's that Cameron Fountain, Braylon Shelby type of player, right? This a beast. This a physical marvel, a physical gem, right? A physical specimen, five star athlete and player. Jerry Smith. So I'm gonna cross my fingers for that kid. Next, we got Philip Bell. Now, Philip Bell is crystal ball to USC. 247 is put a crystal ball to him, to USC, 100%, right? This to make what? The fourth wide receiver in this class. We already got Corey Sims, Danuk Hines, Romero Ison, and then we get this one. It'll be Philip Bell. That's four. We need at least four receivers this class because, you know, last year class, we only got one wide receiver, which was pretty surprising to me that we only get one wide receiver that I want to play in that Lincoln Riley offense, right? But Phillip Bell is a baller, could do any and everything, play slot, outside, kick return, punt return. He just a playmaker waiting to happen. You know what I'm saying? He run nice, crisp routes, run great routes like Daly McCutcheon, one of them route technicians with speed as well and just a playmaker he just natural and he got that receiver aura about him that receiver swag just the way he carry himself his star ride receiver all over this kid i feel like philip bill can make a day one impact at usc for real for real this kid is that talented he can force his way in that rotation from day one one of the most college ready wide receivers out there in the game right now out of mission viejo right you can tell this kid is coached up right and he got a great work effort the way his route tree how he can run every route in the route tree really has no weaknesses in his route running game so all this kid gotta do is keep on developing developing and developing I don't see no weakness in the kid. He got decent size at 6'1", with good speed and great route running. Come on home. So this crystal ball comes with joy. This crystal ball comes with a lot of happiness. I've been hoping USC get Philip Bell for a while. This is my third video I done made on the kid, and it's the third video on Jared Smith. So hopefully the third time the charm, and these kids could come on home to USC, man. Right? Come on home to USC, Mission Viejo, local kid right a local kid so we want to keep them local kids at home we need all the local kids we can get out of the top 10 local players in california we only got one of them i don't like that right we can't give up on building that fence around california and all california products come as a priority to usc so let's bring this kid home and start cooking some of that home pride up and get these Southern California kids with this home pride wanting to represent for SC. We need a star from California that got that charisma and swag and can recruit other players to the fold. Philip Bell is one of those kids, right? 
So Philip Bell, crystal ball to USC. Jerry Smith, five star, finna set his commitment day for August 3rd. So Trojan fans, y'all watch out for these kids. Cross your fingers for Jerry Smith and expect Philip Bell to make his commitment to USC, right? So we get these two kids, we back in the fold, we got back positive momentum and they probably be hating. If we get Jerry Smith, they gonna be mad. They gonna be mad, especially since he's a Auburn Lynn and we could pull a miracle on August 3rd. Then we'd be good, right? Hopefully Coach Henny and Sean Newell is making their last runs, last pitch at this kid, right? To get him to come home to SC. Now we is fighting a hometown battle. This kid is from Alabama, right? And he looking at Auburn. So he might want to stay home, but might not. You know what I'm saying? Just like Dalen McCutcheon, he was crystal ball to USC, but he decided Florida State at the last minute. So you never know what these recruits, you never know what the crystal ball. So let's keep our eye on that. When y'all wake up August 3rd, go check y'all Twitter, go check Carter Sports, go check your USC channels and see what Jared Smith did, because that's going to be important, right? So until then, it's Carter Sports, it's Trojan City, it's SC, so let's go.